What is going on, Luna Classic community? As you know, change is always inevitable. Change is always good. And I'm changing things on this channel slowly but surely to try to provide you with more and more quality entertainment and quality value. So there's going to be some upgrades to things that we're doing coming up in the near future. We're going to be talking about what really is going on in this ecosystem. We're going to be talking about builders, people who are actually in this network doing the work every single day to give you some opportunities uh, to grow this ecosystem. Now, in the context of that, it is important that I point out something, uh, and that is Weeks. If you haven't already, uh, go check out Weeks and start trading today. They are burning. Uh, they are going to burn Luna Classic the same way that Binance is going to burn Luna Classic. So uh, you, you've got another method by which you can burn your luna classic at this point and that's an important thing so let's get into some news let's check everything out and then we'll talk a little bit more about that first no real update on the terraform labs situation nothing's really changed too much there uh crypto exchange joins binance to burn terra luna classic that of course is weeks that's the one that we've been talking about so make sure that you sign up link in the description below i am an ambassador for them so uh, the fact that they're burning it is certainly a, a great opportunity to enhance what it is that we're doing. Uh, maybe move everything from MEXC or a place that's not burning. Move your, all you have to do is transfer it to your wallet and then you start trading. So um, if you want to help out, that's where you're going to go in order to help out. Uh, it's an important thing that, that we're doing here. So we're going to look at some technical analysis. We're going to go over a few of the different things. Uh, there is no governance. There's not a whole lot of things going on, but we're going to use some simple indicators to try to give you an idea of what's going on on these charts. All right, guys, here we are on the chart. Now, this red line I might add here, this is not a top, by the way. This is a projection of where I think the next big move or the impulse move is going to go, if you will. So uh, we are continuing to move upwards along this trend line. You see the trend line starting to get a little more parabolic uh, in its curve right there. Now, is that true? I don't know that that's the case. If it is, it'll be interesting uh, to see it start to, to get really parabolic. But uh, for right now, we did have this wedge move and the wedge move broke to the downside. So that was not the optimal play out right there. But we're going to remove that and we're going to start using the MAs uh, first. The MAs are telling us that we're bouncing off of the 100 with a crossover on the 50 and the 20 is also ripping up here. The 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 pink one, if you will, the yellow one is the 100, the, the green one is the 50 here, uh, and then the red one as you can see right here, this is the 20. These are all um, different kind of, and it, go read this for yourself, but we're bouncing off of all of these down here on this crossover right here, bullish. Now we're going to bounce off the 20 up here and then continue on. So it looks like on the surface that there's some upside momentum. Uh, this is what happens when the RSI kind of flips over and you can see the RSI is certainly oversold right now when it's oversold that usually means that the market is about to rip and, and you're about to have another big move so the signal line seems to be coming down it makes a slower move uh and this seems to be starting to find its way back up so if that's the case then over the next couple of days we got a very bullish indicator telling us that we're on the move now uh removing that Auto fib extension, auto fib, fib extension right now sees a, a big top over here on uh, Luna Classic. So if you, uh, auto fib extension is something that's used, Bitcoin usually just pops out and finishes its move all the way up to the top of these in bull cycles. And we're at the start of a bull cycle. So where we're at right now, as you can see right here, we're in the golden pocket range, which is ironically exactly where we're testing. Now, what happens there? Well, it moves up here, goes past this into these ranges right here, which is basically why we've got this number up here because all indicators were that that was going to be the next big impulse move. But it checks because it's going to come up into this range right here. So uh, that being said, we're probably looking at a 2x from here, at least almost a 3x maybe on a big impulse move if we can get that momentum uh, wave going our way. Now, as we're over a billion market cap, should be an easy thing to see that coming. So well, let's turn that off. Let's look at the high IQ indicator, high IQ indicator, not giving us a signal right now, but it is giving us an indication. You see this line here is turned green. That's because we have uh, 
bear, uh, bullish momentum. Uh, and then this arrow right here means that we are in a bull trend, which is why we have a green up here on the side. Now, uh, buy signal came in. We don't have any, we don't have any uh, buy signal yet. That's an interesting thing. But here we have a, a, an entry for a bearish. And then we had a stop loss right there. That was a, a, an exit. So um, the, the, the indicator has completely switched to a bullish uh, direction, but we haven't had a buy signal yet. So um, if you will, until we get that and you are looking for trading, then I would recommend that you find one of these candles right here by towards the bottom of the candle if you can get it like this right here, because that's where you get the big move to the upside. So this looks like in this pattern scheme right now, when you have that much uh, bullish momentum, if you will, that usually means that there's an upside indicator coming right here. You can see we had a, a nice big one here. Uh, then we had this kind of doji candle, if you will. Now we're getting another doji candle right here. And that usually shows a big move towards that upside. And that checks, by the way, on a lot of these. You can see that one did the same thing. Um, and, and when you see them right there, then you get the little doji in between. Uh, it does mean there's a big move potentially coming. So it's probably a big move coming for Luna Classic. You can kind of see it already playing out. Now, when we look at Super Guppy, Super Guppy is telling us that we are in a momentum wave. This is the green indicator down here telling us that, um, you know, we're in that uh, we're in that paradigm. Now, the question is, will it maintain? Because you can see that it's already kind of moved around here uh, and started to minimize. However, uh, when you look at long term wave indicators, this has been red for a very long time. And look, if you can see here, uh, sometimes you get that momentum wave kind of close the gap a little bit, but then it continues on uh, and then it continues towards that upside. Uh, so uh, with the red, the red seems to be over and now it looks like we're in a bullish window. Bullish windows tend to mean that price go up. So there we are. That's what's going on. So um, cryptonomy.finance just launched a research section. So make sure that you go check that out today. Learn a little bit more about crypto that you may not have known before. If you are a corporate client, you can have a relationship manager uh, and a lot of customer support, superior OTC services, and institutional tools that will help you in your venture. Also, if you sign up for the VIP course, you can get in touch with high-touch wealth management personnel and a lot of different people and personalized information as you need in order to successfully navigate this crypto. Also, if you look at my moves right now, you can see that I'm earning over 106 Solana on my last staking. My Tether, I'm going to earn 1,670 on my staking so far. Uh, you can see there's some of these have, I've earned $784. I can't cash out for a while, but uh, I've earned 784 so far. And then in the launch pool, guys, if you haven't checked the launch pool out, you've got to check the launch pool. Look at these ROIs that I'm getting right now. It's fantastic. Uh, 20 X on K9 Finance, 7X on Weave, on Block Jerk. Uh, if you get, if you put a stake into this system right here, it gives you a fantastic amount of rewards. Go check this out today. There you have it. Luna Classic is in a good position. Uh, Auto Fib extensions telling us that we're about to have a big move. Uh, the the moving averages are telling us we're about to have a big move. Uh, the high IQ hasn't given us a buy signal, but it's trending in the right direction. Super Guppy's telling us that we're in the process of a big move uh, for the continuation of it. I mean, let me know what you think in the comments down below. This is not financial advice, but I'm always right.